Patient tut er is a forma body bull der ente exekutive kreative Direktor vor T San Francisco Art Agent P215 kann, former Agent P215, former Tag, former kann. Welcome an Mr. Scott Duchon, Fiere Salve begin to die, für Advertising. Why advertising? And it's not because I couldn't get into bodybuilding, so let's just we can start there. I wanted to use my imagination, so I started writing creative workshops in college and doing things like that. And it's just one of those things where somebody said, hey, maybe you can have an avenue like that in advertising. Tell me about your mother. My mother. Well, my mother, with this, do we have a lot of time for this, this session? Probably not enough. Look. I'm paying you, Dr. Bulb, okay? My mom is, uh, she believes that she is uh, the reason why I am quote-unquote creative. Uh, took me on trips to New York, to the MoMA, and ballet and theater and all that kind of stuff. And uh, she looks a lot like me, so I know what I'm going to look like in 20 years when I get a sex change. Valid. Sex kanne. Wäre getting some father. Tell me about your father. My father. My father, he's got... Um, some metallic knees and a replaced back. He's kind of a turning into a cyborg right now, actually. So before, when I when he was just my father, he was a regular human being. Now he's a he's some kind of robot. So I'm not really sure how to relate to him. Interesting, Mr. Duhon, talk me to the perfect dinner your parents use. I could I could smell them. I could, the, I could smell the tin can when she was. You know, when she would open it and cook it on the stove and just pour it in a bowl and we would sit down and I'd have my beanie weenies and I'd try and get the perfect mix of beans to hot dogs on a fork or a spoon, maybe even sometimes a spork. Um, I am in textbook seconds of OCD. Let's keep going. I'm your siblings. My sister, yeah, she's three years younger than me and she is a therapist much like yourself. Don't get me wrong, but no body is a key second pump. Are you the young daughters? My brother is, uh, you know, he's 12 years younger than me, so he's just a different generation, so it's always been fun to just kind of um, experiment on him by things like rolling a soccer ball to his left foot because I wanted to make him left-footed. Mr. Duron, did you have a new toys to apply it? I had some frontline guys, I had some snipers, I had a, I had a tank here or there. I would hate to believe I have a, a formula for things, but I definitely hearken. Harken? Harken, that's a weird word. Tell me about the art of the UFOs. Unstoppable is one of those ones where it was just, you know, it was a, a perfect, perfect storm of things coming together. You know, a good idea, an athlete who could pull it off, great um, director, production company, um, sound design, and support of the client. Museum of Humanity of Unstoppable? Um, what do I, which one of my children do I like the most? It's kind of a, a tough question. Fat Inspiration? A lot of shit that, you know, I, from a kid and from things that are fun and silly. So yeah, like, you know, now I'm understanding the toy soldier thing <laughs> a little bit more. But I'm getting as a UFO little key to this custody. Fucking allergic to cats, man. Do you mind if I call you man, Mr. Lightbulb? <laughs> Last question. Your sister was a good boy. My sister judges me a lot in her little, you know, one-on-one -on -one therapy, so I'm gonna go with you, Dr. Bulb. I hope you have a brain of summer assistance on your part of prime. Mm -hmm.